try the speedway? Forget it. We've already completed it. Hey there, one SoCal playing as Spyro 3. It's boss time! You know, this game is known for its boss time. <laughs> Play Spyro games for the bosses, naturally. Alright, we should talk to everyone, just in case. You can use the whirly gig whenever you are ready. Oh boy. Alright. Just hop on, Spyro. Shiny, that's the your name. The sky shall be your domain. New worlds await you. Thank you. You did not mention a season. Hop aboard. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Keeping it fresh and simple. The world take you far away. Just jump aboard. What mm -hmm. is your accent? I don't know. Oh. Uh. Evening late. We could just go there. Right, right, and that's what's going to confer the existence of the boss. Right, that's how it works. Spike is born. All right, uh, Spike. You bumbling, idiotic, worthless fool. I ask you to carry out one simple task, and you fail me. I should have known better than to rely on a child. But don't worry about it. I'll deal with them now. These eggs can't be worth all this trouble. Without the dragons, the magic in this world will wither away. Without magic, I'll die. And so will your ever so slim chance of becoming a sorceress. Now, watch how a real squishy. sorceress dispatches her enemies. How would you like some dragon for lunch? I love dragon. All right. Big old Minotaur, huh? Kinda. A tricorn. Is it kind of a horn if it's on the shoulders? I I don't know. Like those are spikes. They're not horns at that point, right? Like horns have to be on a head. Like not only that, like they need to be like something specific, because antlers are not horns. Hey there, bird. My tactical instincts told me the sorceress would attack you here. Oh, so good. I flew in to help out. It seems my rocket launchers don't affect this creature. Of course. But I can assist you by dropping ammunition. Now get in there and fight the good fight. Wait, ammunition of what? <laughs> Alright, so okay, you got like a gun on your okay, so you're giving me things to throw like that, huh? Oh, 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 that's how we're fighting. Got it. I'm just gonna miss. All right, it's so like big bombs. Got it. I did it. I blew you up. So right now, I am content just kind of running around. And it's like, huh. There we go. There we go. That did a small amount of damage. I mean, his... Oh, oh, oh. Just punch my thing. I'm supposed to be headbutting that to you. Whoa, where did that bomb come from? Hey, I did it. Oh, oh, uh. Alright, we got cracks. We got a. I don't know what that is on the ground. Is that what I am meant to use? Okay, big fire wave. Well, he just touched it with his hammer, so. Okay, no, yeah, that is what I'm supposed to be using. Uh, oh, what? What did I- okay. Oh, wait. Do I have fire? I think I had, like, better fire? Yeah, I had, like... Okay, okay, it's a fire improvement crystal. Uh. And I can turn around and he can punch me and flatten me like a pancake. Alright, we did it! So this is much more of a direct fight than, um... Previous boss was. What? What? No! How did that? That did not touch me. I guess it touched me. Got it. All right, that hurt him. Blue. Still four shots. Why'd you put all the crystals at the same spot, bird? Uh... Oh, I see! He gets the power, too! 
Uh, that is not the effect I expected. And I'm dead. Like, I didn't think blue crystal meant you're gonna spit it out real good. Ah, dude. So yeah, that gives him fire ability, now we can do that move, we got it. And of course Bird is giving him like all the power-ups. me. That hit him. He's like he's sitting like right on top of one. Alright, I managed to nab it. Whoa. Okay! Okay! I managed to do it! Monique is here. It's a good thing he was holding on to an egg. <laughs> I don't know why. Seems like a bad idea. Like if you know he's gonna go and fight Spyro. Alright, he wanted to heal. I get it. But no, it's your familiar that needs to devour it, you silly fool! We did it. Together, we all survived. Or something similar to that. Alright, Evening Lake! Alright, so once again, we got ourselves an overworld to run around. There's a rainbow! Dashing rainbow! <laughs> Hello. Listen to me, dragon. Hey. Spyro. Hi. This is serious now. Uh-huh. The sorceress is planning a trap for you, and if she catches you... Believe me, you don't want to know what she's gonna do. Look, I promise to take good care of the rest of the eggs. I mean it. Just take Hunter and go back home before... Before... I can't say it! Just go! Alright. Well, I'm not heeding that warning. Here we go! So, evening late. I mean, all the... Ooh, what's that? It's a rocket ship. Okay, so that's what we're gonna take to go to World 4. Alright. Yeah, brand new overworld. Another very pleasant looking area. Like, they're just always pretty pleasant. Fry this frog. It seems pretty cruel, and I agree with myself. You can go up these stairs if you want. Where there's nothing. Yeah! Oh, but there's like a lot of water here, actually. Alright, well, here we go. We world through the world water. I mean, swimming in this game is like, fantastic. Uh, it's just scary because it adds like, a lot more... Uh, po hiding possibility for, for things. Get out here, bro. Oh, that was very rude. I'm aware. Like, it's a lot easier to hide things if then things can be like, at any height. But, you know what? That's okay. That's totally fine. Alright, let's destroy this jug. Get its content. And do that again, and again, and again. Alright. Um, okay. Alright. Oh, look at that fish. Look at that whale. Hey, whale can be devoured by a whale. There's an egg here. <laughs> what are you doing, Jonah? Okay. Cool. I'm glad I was the opposite of punished for that. <laughs> That's 
So remember, kids, if you're ever swimming underwater in a fantasy world and a whale is opening its mouth, let yourself get devoured. It's gonna be fine. In fact, you're gonna be rewarded for it. Alright, that's just some piece of wood. There's some, like, lamps here. It's pretty good. Alright, anything fun here? What's the entrance of the world? Yeah, that's right. Fireworks factory, of course. Don't, I don't think you want your firework factory to be doused, though. I swear this. Sure can. Just use your big ol' head. There we go. Kinda look, kinda sorta like, like a crack. Hey, little guy, Stewie. Stewie's gotten itchy. Poor little thing. All the jugs are here. Isn't that not amazing? Not, not really. Jugs are like everywhere. Oh, uh, the boat is a level. That should not come as a surprise. Not as a shock. Where else can I go? Well, here's a temple. There's a level there. Yeah, that makes sense. And here's a jug. Still have a gem. That also makes sense. How about this jug here, huh? So what's up with here? Hello. Hey, there's a Yeti I heard about that doesn't <laughs> The sorceress exist. has a real prize on her hands here. It took two dozen Rhinox to capture this dim-witted furball, so you'd better believe he's not going to get out cheap. And so, she still accepted to let you Where tend to him? Where are you getting all this money, Spyro? <laughs> it's not just lying around on the ground, is it? Yeah, and where uh, are you getting you? all these eggs ah, you're supplying all it's over the place, huh? Now. A duplicitous larcenous ursine. Ah, ah, the first rejuvenating breath of freedom. With the humility of a wounded sparrow, I genuflect to my noble deliverer. Uh, it was no big deal, dude. Yes. <coughs> Spiral's After voice all, is louder than everyone's. I who let you out. Why, you brazenly avaricious, duplicitous, larcenous ursine! Now hold on! <coughs> One more, perhaps? At least. Please do afford me the sublime honor of enjoying your visitation in the nearest future. Yeah, sure. All right, you know, you, you tend to think about a yeti, you think he's gonna talk like a caveman, but no, he has a very erudite vocabulary. I'm assuming all the words was using were, like, correct. All right, so Bentley, that's his name, he has an outpost, wow. All right, well, that's the first thing we're gonna be doing next time. Hopefully I can find this cave zone again. Alright, uh, yeah, still looking for things. So this, okay, so this is the starting area. Like, I'm missing, like, a lot, probably, right? Cly to the tower. Hmm, so there's gliding to do, too, somewhere. Oh, there's an up here. Hello. Yeah, like there's a shoreline. It's not all underwater. There we go. Yeah, I mean. So if I, so if my familiar eats sufficient of these butterflies, this may eventually lead to a one-up. Is what I understand. You are. Yeah, that is exactly what happened. Hi again, Spyro. Hey. This power-up can make you invincible, but only cool. for a short while. Okay. Use it to get by these flame spitters. You'll find an egg when you get past them. I can literally see the egg right now. Oh, whoops. And, uh, I have hit a failure state. So basically, this is a way to have a, uh, like a time limit. Like, can you do this platforming course within the time limit? The answer is yes, I'm afraid. It's Stuart! Stuart with a baseball cap. You were born with that. That's just upsetting. 
there's something here, yeah. Alright, uh, and all the frogs you can destroy, so, you know, eat well, familiar! I need you to get strong! I need you to get powerful, and also I need you to get all these gems for me. Look, this is a busy day for a busy moment for Sparks. Alright, got everything here. I mean, and that's not the tower, right? That is a tower. No, that's I'm Invincible, yeah. Glide to the tower. Oh, there's a up here. For a hot minute! Like, to me, that just looked like, uh... Like texture, but uh, I had uh, suddenly an extreme memory from uh, a certain video game called Spyro 2. Oh, hello. <laughs> Hi. Hey, Ted. How's it going? Living on your equination here, huh? Well, not anymore. Uh, from here, is there anywhere fun I could get to? I mean, I could get to that tower, but is this the tower? Or do I need to get all the way over there, huh? That's what I'm thinking. I'm supposed to go all the way there. Uh, is this a good gliding zone to do that? I feel like they're closer. Maybe from here? Oh, yeah, absolutely. I think I was supposed to do this first. Like, you notice that this is here, then you go like, wee, then you go on like this half ledge, and you realize you cannot actually go there. But what I did notice is that this is facing that. There's another climbing zone right here. On the water. From the water. Climb from the water. Oh, this is the spark area too. All right, return here in a century or two. Something good will happen to you. Hopefully. Uh, right here, oh yeah, this is easy, super town, breezy, egg. Hannah! You're free! Alright. Yeah, do your Hannah dance. Beautiful. Alright, uh... I'm missing an amount of gem. How many? 20. That could be two purples. Oh, there's a speedway. Uh... Oh, and when I said two purple, I meant two gold. Like, these two golds I just got. <laughs> There's the speedway in front of this one. Man, this level, this world is strangely organized. But I got everything pretty quickly. Wait. Did, oh, did the door just close? I guess it closed when um, I we went into the cutscene for Bentley. Got it! Well, that's all very nice and good and great. Oh no, yeah, next time I should do Bentley World. Right, before I return to World 2. You, you're right, self. And it's over here, right? It is. Alright, next time, we meet a Yeti. Yeah, oh yeah, that's what makes sense to me.